Welcome to another episode of God of War Ragnarok. All right, in the last episode, we had just got here um, with these um, with these smiths, smithies, um, and we had defeated the um, the huntress. Um, so now we're going to continue on into our story. Um, y'all just make sure y'all like, subscribe. Um, and we're going to see how this thing goes. Finding everything all right, I'm still learning, though, you know. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader from New Mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will you help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. Hmm. I'm curious. I've always wanted to see your home realm. Svartalfheim sounds unique. Svartalfheim? Huh. Stupid Aesir name. We look like dark elves to you. Oh, right. You call the realm something else. Nidavellir, which is also the name of the capital city and where you should look for Durlin. Damn city so full of Odin fuckers nowadays. It ain't hardly somewhere a self-respecting dwarf would show his face. Harsh, but accurate. All right, let's roll out. <laughs> you hear that? Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. Hmm. All right. We'll just need the Bifrost and the head. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, wow. you stodding bastard! <laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it! <laughs> oh! That's it! That's it! Good! Now, release! Still unpleasant! Oh, that's our cue! Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Russell got eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just <gasps> there! That should do it! I guess this is how we travel around the realms here. See? 
No permanent damage. So I can probably start exploring now and do whatever I want to do in between the missions. Throw me at him. Horns first. Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> the Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on. Let me show you how it works. Okay. Aim your key at the room for Svartalfheim on the right. Then concentrate. I'm pressing X. Why is there nothing happening? Oh! So I gotta hit this, the gateway. Gotcha. <clears throat> this should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. <laughs> the grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! Whoa, do you feel that? What's that like? Anything, everything. It's warm. We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it free. Uh, Careful, uh, lad. Ah! Another wrench to the left. <laughs> 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 Why are these things so fast? already off to a lively start. Atreus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said ferry appears to be missing. Huh. <gasps> I 
still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have cut that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. They are resources. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say... Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. Did you see that over there? That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know, it is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. Hmm. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water would be frozen in the second. What if we frozen in a second, huh? Brother, you think freezing it would work? What if you used your axe on it? Maybe I should take it there. Aha! Nope. Don't need to do that. What's that? Where's the third? Huh. Interesting. Collect the and, and doom apples. Maximum health increase. Ah, oh, okay. I think that's dirty enough to cross. Aye, 
Good old dwarven craftsmanship. <laughs> Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Okay, there's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. You know what? Sorry, son, but... <laughs> We can go over there. Well, there. Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. Is that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Sparklefine. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Wow, 
job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartalfarm? I lied. Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far see, my more is not the gaseous best. in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects mm -hmm. were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Nothing here. All right. Think we can fit under that bridge? About to find out. I think we can. <clears throat> so I guess that's a checkpoint where we need to be. What is that yellow thing in there? Ah. Okay. Do a runic power. You need just a drink from the dew of the. I didn't get a chance to read that. Okay. I'll read it later when I edit this video. All right. I think I can do a better job of comboing those guys when they when I put them in the air. There's things I could do. With this um thing here. They sure don't tell you nothing this thing here, do they? You say ain't there, but you ain't saying, but you ain't pointing. I don't know what there is.
find anything good up there? Got some raw hide. I don't know what that is. Um, maybe it's something for crafting. But I'm always game for, you know, materials, things I might need for the game. Okay, where am I supposed to go? They cap those geysers. <laughs> hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Nah, I know the problem in this game. It's a lot of puzzles. And I hate puzzles. Okay, we froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? 
up there, but how am I supposed to get to that? How am I supposed to get to that? If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth. Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. strange bugger pop back out of the ground again. I didn't see nothing. It's too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. Now what? Father, uh, up there. <laughs> Halfway 
over there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Of course there is. And there's going to be more puzzles to get it open. I hate puzzles. With a passion. I just want to go beat up stuff. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. Of course it is. Alright. Think you can uncover that geyser from here? I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. <laughs> nice one. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Oh, that was too much. That's one of Cavassia's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. hoping to learn from Tia. Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. OK. 
Okay. So we got past that um that earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's that puzzle, but the I hate puzzles. Make my hair hurt. unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fumble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellia, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body. And was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. <sighs> the buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. Statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Or fear him. Hello. I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. Are they up there? <laughs> Is this something else for me to figure out? Where the boy in the... You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow?
Oh, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it? What's it gonna be this time? <sighs> Patience! I find it's best to see these things... Oh, in action! Ah! Take aim at that gate there, but before you loose, say, Ski Alpha. Ski Alpha. Ski Alpha. Ah! Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a lair. How was I supposed to know they were there? Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri. Any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to call it quits this episode, and we'll see you again in the next one. Um, and then we'll go further inside. All right, y'all take care.